Barnaby's at it again. First of all, he was confused by what family values meant, and this time he's confusing government with family businesses. But here is the Oxford Dictionary definition of what a family business is. Perhaps they don't have dictionaries in Canberra. As you know, politics is a family business. I mean, this is insane that a partner who probably knows more about your office than anybody else can't work in your office. It's insane that, that there will be a better contribution to that office than most other people. You should let your partner work in the office. They will understand more about where you're supposed to be, more about how you're going to get there, more about you know, what you're able to do and what you're not able to do than anybody else. Now, that's number one. The second thing is, if they're qualified to do the job, if they have the qualifications, then why not allow them to do it? We have this peculiar um, law that says, oh, well, if you're a partner, you can't work in the office. Well, there are some instances where people say I prefer that was not the case, and other instances where people say I prefer that was the case. And it really is, in many instances, if you want to support the word family, then you should let it be run as a family business, which means you should allow family members to work in the business to make sure that you can do the very best job for your electorate. So based on that statement, Barnaby, we can assume that you didn't do or couldn't do your very best because your previous wife didn't work in your family business called government. What a prank. Well, there are some instances where people say I prefer that was not the case, and other instances where people say I prefer that was the case.